it's time once again to awaken the spirits of ghost theater the voice of a very old spirit comes to us once again from the mists far beyond the realm of the other side from an impossible distance yes though from as close as a lover's breath one we are to know only as bella and so she speaks to us now as before through myself as has been told and foretold by the prophesies of the ancients the realm of woman and of man is indeed in the midst of dire and uncertain times true enough but it has also been said and truthfully so that life is first and foremost a classroom a classroom of the soul it has once been said and there are indeed lessons to be learned even from the darkest of times possibly even all the more so lessons carved in the wisdoms of the ages that might perchance guide us through the most troubled of waters such as be kind and rewind don't be cruel particularly to a heart that's true if you have to do something do it well and always remember to flush be yourself for everyone else is taken though perhaps in some cases you should maybe not be better than you are or perhaps much better as the case may be particularly if you are not all that good to begin with for nobody likes an orifice unless it's the good kind of course know that life is a gift one that should not be returned unopened nor should it be unnecessarily or dismissively discarded having a little fun with it however can be exceptionally fine and then some know that the wisdoms of the ancients are written on the wind and in the music of the trees and are sometimes to be found in the not so hidden messages of commercial breaks though only the good ones of course know that the words of the prophets are written on the facebook walls sometimes with pictures or with cute videos though often times accompanied by mindless comments of nonsense know too that sometimes the really good stuff rhymes with the poetry of magic though sometimes the rhyming admittedly can get a bit annoying remember to take the presumed news of the day with the tiniest granule of salt or perhaps a pound particularly if it's fake or if it's sparking fear mongering hate mongering nonsense at you seriously you should know better be wary of the decepticon of silver tongue lies because he knows what it is that you think you want even if he isn't all that particularly bright always remember to that there is a season for everything a time to turn and a time for love preferably after work remember to that love is all you need just like the song says but there's other stuff too of course know that love is a battlefield and a big gun never hurts except when it does know that love hurts true but it can sometimes hurt so very good know that love is indeed blind but it is sometimes deaf and stupid too know that love stinks just like another song says which is why one should always shower well before heading home know also that love can come easy true enough but at its best it makes things hard because love is just funny that way sometimes and lastly and above all else and this is perhaps the most important lesson of all don't be an asshole follow this and all else will fall into place as it may or not your humble guide here again it would seem the mysterious spell has once again departed and returned to her place in the wherever perhaps for good possibly not only time will tell or not and 
So, until next we meet at the precipice of the great and distant beyond, remember to dismiss the wisdoms of the ancients at your own folly, for some things are not meant to be known by the living, true enough, though we should abide by them all the same. And so, goodbye.